This video will cover the process of water content determination for a given soil sample. In order to do this, you need the following. An empty can, a balance, and an oven which is set on 100 degrees Celsius. First, make sure that the can is clean and dry. Then, put a sticker on your can or mark it with a marker. After that, measure the weight of the empty can. Then, add your moist soil to the can. After that, measure the weight of the can with the moist soil. Put your can in the oven for 24 hours, allowing the water within the soil to evaporate. After 24 hours, the soil will be completely dry. Again, measure the weight of the can with the dry soil. Now the calculation part. Water content equal to the weight of water within the soil divided by the weight of the solid particle within the soil. We have here some data that has been obtained from a laboratory experiment. As we mentioned before, water content equal to the weight of water divided by dry soil. Select the cell below water content. Then write equal. Then select the cell below the can with wet soil subtracted from the can with the dry soil we should put parentheses and then divided by we should select the can with the dry soil and subtract it from the can weight empty one and put parentheses again press enter we got the answer to apply the formula for the below cell just click and drag and we got the water content for the soil. In order to obtain the average, write sum. First, you have to write equal. Sum, open the parentheses, then click and drag to obtain the average. Click equal, select on the sum cell, and divide it by three, since we have three cell. And this is the average. To obtain the water content in percentage, click equal, select it, and times 100 obviously the number is has too many digits after the decimal in order to round it just write round open the parentheses and after your formula put a comma and select how many number you want after the digit for example 3 close the parentheses press enter and here is the answer and by that, we will be able to determine the water content ratio of the soil.